All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to CADCAST episode number 708. I'm your host, GBD, here in Long Island, New York. And as always, we're joined by a man who is so preoccupied by his box mattress that he got a job at UPS to ensure its delivery. Wombat. I mean, I, I guess. I just That's wanted to funny. say box mattress. Okay. You don't like my box mattress? I don't know. You, I don't know. I don't know anything about it. I know that they leave it on your front door half of the time. Mm -hmm. Yes, there's a 50-50 shot <laughs> that your mattress will show up if you order a box mattress. I don't like those odds. Mm, I mean, I have it. Is it good? I slept on it once. And? Uh, it, it was... Never again. Never, <laughs> ever once. again. Now it goes straight into trash. No. You, it was you don't lovely. sound like you like it, though. It, it, it's, it's, you got to break it in. I got to break it in. It's a different, it's a completely okay, different okay, night's sleep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so for those who are wondering, yes, the mattress showed up. It showed up exactly the day they said it was. You, you would love this. You would have loved this. I should have saved the footage for my camera. Because the UPS truck pulled up across the street from my house, as opposed to right in front of my house. That was thing number one that made me go, oh, my God, please, you can't do this to me. Second thing is the guy comes out and he looks like uh, one of the dude wears my car guys, like just like spot on. Like he wasn't even wearing UPS clothes, just like stoner guy. Out he there. killed the UPS driver, probably. So, yeah, probably. And. He walks over and all he has in his hand is like a small package. Okay. That's all he has in his hand right. is this like little small package. Right. Is this? And he says my address. I go, yeah. He goes, all right, man, here you go. Mattress, and mattress in a small... bag. <laughs> and I'm like, don't you have like a larger package for me? He goes, oh, yeah, the other guy's getting that out now. It's just big, so it takes a little while. Two guys. Like, all right. Whoa. Yeah. I was just like. What, what, you know what's going on here the the look of my face all the color like i could feel the blood rush out of my face when the guy handed me this little bag of stuff my wife ordered from the gap and i'm like no <laughs> this, this that's is uh, definitely your only package this is it i've never it seen like, a ups truck with two guys before meaning i don't think the other guy worked for ups he just like his buddy, just like, hey, just ride along with me for yeah, like. Yeah, I was like, hey, man, this is my last stop. Let's just, you know. They only have one chair in, in the, in he the car. He was like the winter, winter soldier. It was just kind of tagging along with uh, Falcon <laughs> the entire time. Just like, I don't know why I'm here. Nothing else to do. <laughs> yeah. Help these guys exactly. with these heavy packages. That is weird because the trucks only have one seat. Uh, He's riding on the roof. Know. Yeah. Like and the other soldier. guy then came with the, uh, with the dolly and the other, and the mattress, and he's like, and I'm like, do you need help with that? Do you want me to at least help you get it up the up to the steps to the porch? He's like, no, don't worry about it. I got it. And he, he was like, by the second step, I felt so bad because the guy's like, but, what a wimp. He needed a, a dolly for that thing. Mm -hmm. It was in a box even. It was 120 pounds. <clears throat> Whatever. That's nothing. Mm -hmm. I told you but, I, yeah. that one Russian guy had my whole California King mattress on his back. It wasn't even in a box. He just had the whole thing like on him and he just walked. No problem. Like <laughs> walked he upstairs in the backyard. It's like and, no time to switch out the mattresses. Everything was done. It sounds like it sucks though. Cause you sound like, like you couldn't no, sleep it's last really, night. It's really, uh, it's no, that's not, I just didn't get to that yet. You look tired though. I, <laughs> I always look tired. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> that's normal. So we get the mattress on the bed. We wait for it to rise. It's like a good two inches higher than my old mattress, which I'm totally not used to. Like I went to, you know, because this is too much information. I went to clip my toenails before I before going to bed. Uh, yeah, uh, uh, like, like that's so gross. We all do it. So I, put, I usually just, new bed. just I went to go put my right foot in there. on the bed, but I'm not used to it being so much higher. Wait, you're literally clipping your toenails on your new bed. On the, like, on that's the first the thing. First thing, got to break foot? in this your bed. Foot, your foot is on the bed, clipping mm -hmm. the toenails. Not like your other. Like you're like, like you're not sitting on the bed. You're putting your your foot. I went on to the go bed. put my. Well, the thing is, it was too high and I couldn't do it. So the point is, I I couldn't clip my toes on the bed anyway. You're saying you can't get your foot up onto your bed? I can't like lift my whole what leg up. Do, what, what are you doing? I are can't you putting, tonight, like, a towel today, down though. or something like. 
where are all your your toenail clippings going? I brush them off with my hand after. It's on top of the on top. I don't do it under the bed. Brush them off where? Into my hand and throw oh. them away. I thought it was like a cracker barrel. It's not like they're going all over the place. What do you think I'm doing? Oh, they have the, some of these clippers. They'll actually catch the clippings. They got that this little one cover will on. Catch it. Mo- yeah, we'll get most of them. I just do mine directly like into the toilet. Up. Huh? I just do mine oh. directly into the toilet. Well, I mean, what can you do? Does it really matter? But anyway, I do. No, this is shocking to me. It's like Shock. I have a brand new bed and oh. no nails. Well, it wasn't on them. It's but I, again, I don't see the correlation. It's not like they were under the blanket. You, shipwreck feels like you've sullied the bed by putting by putting your bare foot on it. And no, it's not the bare foot. It's it's the it's it's the toenail. Shrapnel. It's the toenail shrapnel. It's, it, yeah, but it, I clean it off after. It's not like it stays there. You but you might puncture it. Yeah, exactly. What's gonna happen? You could puncture. Under- Isn't that the wave hybrid? All of the waves could come out. It's gonna go through the comforter, through the sheet. Through the water. Okay, so he's got all the stuff on there, shit. And no into problem. the mattress. He's, I'm like, totally I covered up. There's literally three layers in between the mattress and my foot. I say it's fine, but I feel like you hate the bed though, and that you no, didn't sleep I don't. well. Why no. is this it's so hard? It's not. It's very soft. You actually lay down on it, and it's you know, it's I've never had like a memory foam type thing. Right. And it's got one layer of memory foam. And so the coils, and after and that. then it's got the coils underneath it. So you lay in it, and I, know, it's I like got the tent, same you, fucking yeah. thing. If you listen to your own show, you'd learn that I, I bought the same fucking mattress the month before. I'm explaining to the listeners. <laughs> they listen to the show. They don't right. listen to the show. They don't. I know. I read the comments. Then the top layer is nothing but toenails. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> that's the that's the hybrid uh, wave hybrid also, supreme. It's, it's, <laughs> it's kind of rounded, like on the edges. It's not like you know it's not like a full square it's more like a rounded mm, mattress. holds more toenails <laughs> it holds more toenails no but what you're not used to is when you gotta just kind of lean on it and you just slide right down because that happened to my wife today. on the edge <laughs> yeah see you had to get edge support see ours has edge support so when you sit on the edge you're just like no toenails they're all in the middle i don't mind it <laughs> We went, we went from like a really super low bed to like one that's a foot taller. So I went from like having to like get up in the middle of the night to pee to have to like really work out to get, to get out of the bed. And now I just roll right out. It's awesome. Anyway, and the fucking is fantastic. Right, Wombat? I don't know that yet because my wife had to go into the office today. Oh, okay. Yeah. Maybe tomorrow. Oh, it I'll bounced. let you know. It has a bounce. Mm-hmm. Bounce. Got to get ready for the bounce. My old bed had no bounce. It's it significantly like, better than my old mattress. I don't know how great it is yet because it's only been one night. Is that fair? Is that a fair? I'm, ha- I'm happy for you. Thank you. Right. I yep. also got a new hat. No one's talking about that. It says Pit Panthers. It was a gift from a friend of mine. You guys wouldn't know him. Pit Johnny Pit. It's from Shipwreck. It was mm-hmm. from Shipwreck. He sent it to you. It was something he, he bought at Target for $2. I think it was three dollars. That was close. I'm good. Uh-huh. I'm good at this game. Yeah. But you know what? It's what? my favorite hat, so I don't care. All right. Looks I, good on you. Mm-hmm. Thank you. I got handmade cashmere hats from Osaka Grandma, and a nice cloth cotton one for the for the springtime and the summertime. It's gonna absorb Everybody my yellow. Everybody wins. It's gonna absorb my yellow head grease very nicely going to be an interesting experiment to see what that looks like. Anyway, now that we're all caught up on the great mattress saga of 2021, mm-hmm. it is interesting. I The most interesting thing about that story is that like people steal mattresses from the UPS warehouses. Like there's just going to, there's just some breakage that's yeah, And there's inevitable. no, and now, because now I know that everything that the UPS guy told me when I went, remember when I went to go pick yeah, up the Yeah, mattress, yeah, yeah, you had a learning I know everything the UPS guy was telling me was a, load of, was a load of BS when he was telling me what he thought happened. Oh. Because he was like, oh, I bet the label just fell off on one of the rollers, and now it's just sitting there, and they don't know where the address is. It's They write your address on the box in addition to putting two labels on it. Right. They know about that scenario. Yeah. Uh, now the they Casper do. people. No, the Casper people know. <laughs> it's Yeah, it's... uh. They don't want to tell you that your shit was stolen. I'm pretty sure they're instructed to never tell you your package mm-hmm. was stolen. But like, yeah, there's no doubt in my mind that mattress was stolen, probably resold. 
Probably the mafia. Maybe. The mattress mafia. I mean, I've the seen mattress, Goodfellas. Mattress mafia. Yes. They, have, they sell everything. They resell everything. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I just got the 4K disc for uh, Casino because it was on sale at Best Buy. And they sent me a $5 reward certificate. They te teased me with a $5,000 reward certificate. But it was $5. Anyway, that looks good, by the way. I watched the first five minutes of it. They made that movie more colorful in 4K. How about some show feedback? Sure, there wasn't much on the show thread, so I had to go to YouTube. So you had to make up some? Yeah, to make up, to make up comments. And even that was sort of lousy. So. <laughs> well, with the criticism of the comments, you're not really in, in being inviting for more comments. No, I'm telling people to get their act together if they care about this section of the show. Maybe they just don't care. Probably. Mm -hmm. Well, read something. Oh, sure. But Cats2079 had to say, I was not expecting a video podcast. That's awesome. I'll be watching the whole thing soon. I just wanted to say hi. And I just want to stop it right there and say, yes, we do a video podcast. Some people are watching this right now live on Twitch. We do it Wednesday nights at nine. And if you missed that, you could always watch it on YouTube at the CADCast YouTube channel, which is where I grab these comments from. So if you like your podcast in video form, you can do that. And you can see what kind of cool t-shirts Shipwreck is wearing. And oh, me. Yes. I have that t-shirt, Wombat, so it's not that I cool. Can't oh, be that I cool. see. Yeah, yeah. I get it. I get it. I get it. Oh, I, Isbel, this is an Isbel shirt. Jason no. Isbel. Isbel. Isbel, yeah. Is it's no. Isbel Wombat, you know, it's not Isbel. Did you know that? You didn't you knew that? I don't really I take every pronunciation shipwreck gives with a grain of salt. <laughs> he's but this one he's got Even, street cred though. On yeah, this I one. Think, oh, coming at you from every like, angle. If you ask shipwreck how it's pronounced, I'm sure it's Isbif. <laughs> <laughs> he was in town for two nights. So I gotta gotta hang out with him. How was it? It was good. Nice. It was good. We hadn't seen each other in two and a half years for some reason. Yeah, I wonder why. Yeah. So no, he put on a good show. It's everybody should go see him when he's in their town. If they have a vaccine, if not get a vaccine, yep. go see him in New York. Yeah. You have to get a vaccine. Yep. He told me some good stories, but I can't really tell him on here. Right. I mean, <laughs> but, tell us off air. I will. He's yeah. uh, he's got a, he's got a movie coming out. I don't know if you know about that. Yeah. Yeah. It's a Scorsese movie. It is a Scorsese movie. He was telling me uh, about some scenes that, that he and uh, Leo DiCaprio have. That's good. That's there. pretty awesome. Did they do you? look alike. Like when you look at them next to each other now, especially with the goatee, there is that weird resemblance. Even he posted, someone commented on it and he retweeted it. And I saw the side by side. I'm like, wow, they do kind of look alike. So. Mm. You say Just so. saying. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You'll, you'll like that movie, GP. Of course. Is that a Netflix movie? It must be, right? Must uh, deal. I think it's a Paramount Plus, Apple, oh. Apple TV Plus. This Paramount Plus, like I gotta not sign up for one thing at least, right? Paramount Plus, at least anything but Paramount Plus. I, I would a, say Paramount Plus is probably still better than Peacock, but I wouldn't sign up for it. It's called Killers of the Flower Moon. You lost me already. Oh, I'm sure it's great. I mean, come no, on. no, it, it's a, it's a, like a true story. About be good. flower it's moons. About, it's no, it's it's about uh, Native Americans and these white guys that went and married them so they would get their their land. This is uh Getty and all of that, how they got rich off of the oil. Is De Niro gotcha. in it or no? Yes. He's yeah, yeah. yeah he had so. some he had some uh stories about wow about Bob. Bobby well. D. Yep. Nice. That's, that's awesome. Very cool. Uh what do we got? We got Jet Jab. Also Brendan yes. Fraser. Oh, well they, now I'm sold. Brendan Fraser. You love him. I am him. Yep. Look. Stop! Stop wheezing the juice. <laughs> juice. Sure he says that juice. in this movie. Juice, juice, wheeze juice, wheeze juice. Stop wheezing the juice. <laughs> <laughs> I want to remake that movie with you. you can do okay, that. I think we should. <laughs> Jell Bizoner has to say that camo sweaty shirts. It's pronounced really Jizz Boner. Is... You pronounce yeah, it wrong. Jizz Boner. Whatever yes. it is, he just he just applauds your use of the camo shirt to hide sweat. But you're not wearing a camo shirt tonight. I'm not. So. I don't plan on sweating much here. No, I do. I buy. I have all all the shirts that I work out in at Orange Theory have some sort of camouflage pattern. 
because I just get soaking wet through that shit. And nobody needs to know that much. I mean, they can see on my head and shit, but they don't need to see how gross it really is. And it works. It's really effective. So, uh, yeah, that's all I got to say about that. I recommend nice. it. I recommend it. Okay. 